So as private companies change course on guns, will lawmakers follow suit? President Trump was certainly pushing them in that direction during a bipartisan meeting at the White House today. I'm not into popularity. I'm into getting something done that's good. I don't want President to Trump defying Republican orthodoxy, siding with Democrats on dramatically expanding background checks and raising the purchasing age for semi-automatic weapons. It doesn't make sense that I have to wait till I'm 21 to get a handgun, but I can get this weapon at 18. I don't know. So I was just curious as to what you did in your bill. We, you don't we, didn't, we didn't address it, Mr. President. Look, I think you know we, why? Because you're afraid of the NRA, right? No. <laughs> the police saw that he was a problem. They didn't take any guns away. Now, that could have been policing. I think they should have taken them away anyway, whether they had the right or not. Take the guns first. Go through due process second. The president's fellow Republicans say they want to protect Second Amendment rights, even allowing gun owners to carry concealed weapons across state lines. I'm with you, but let it be a separate bill. You'll never get this passed. If you add concealed carry to this, you'll never get it passed. The session ended with Congressman Ted Deutsch, who represents Parkland, giving the president a bracelet honoring Stoneman Douglas students. If we can do universal background checks and ban bump stocks and increase the age to 21 and get rid of the Dickey Amendment and do it now mm -hmm. and show the American people and my constituents and the people in Parkland, the grieving families and the students that we're actually ready to act, they'll feel better and you can get this done, Mr. President. And I want thank to you. give that okay, to you. Okay, thank you very much. Thanks. This is the second time in two months the president has brought Republicans and Democrats together to try to work through a difficult political issue. His January session on immigration reform has yet to produce a bill. We'll see what happens at his meeting today.